I saw a video, the very first video I saw of you on TikTok, right? And it was yeah. you. It was you showing your boyfriend. He seemed to be a foreigner, right? You were showing. Yeah, him, he is. You, you were showing him your village, right? And that's what caught my attention. I was like, why is this guy in a foreign place being shown a village, and you would give him a, a, a tour? H how did you guys meet? Um, we met in a dating app, you know, and we fell in love. And Let me show this video of you showing him around the village. Sure. I mean, the kid seems excited to see him. Yeah, because it's it's um it's rare that there's um foreigner come in our village, and I think um he's the first foreigner came there. <laughs> you have on your page that you're a lady boy right yeah that's right and i am a lady boy <laughs> you're, you're a lady boy and that's pretty uh that's pretty a common thing in in the philippines right it's you guys are pretty open about that was he aware that you were a lady boy when he came to the philippines yeah he actually um uh we actually met in a dating app which is you just only find lady boy okay, okay. so we met there and yeah so i don't have any doubt that he won't gonna accept me or i will going to have any problem about my about introducing my gender to him mm -hmm. because the moment that he signed up in that dating app he knows that the girls there are lady boy Mm -hmm. Okay. Why do you guys label yourself lady boys rather than just saying transgender or, you know? Well, um, for me, um, it doesn't matter. You know, I can consider myself as a trans woman, mm -hmm. trans, uh, you know, trans or trans girl, she male or lady boy. I think they are all the same. Got you. You know, but yeah, and but. I do prefer, you know, to be called like a lady boy because I think it's more um so people will, you know, um certainly distinguish, you know, what's my gender is, you know. Gotcha. Because lady but boy. <laughs> so you guys don't do surgery, you guys take a pill. Right. Is the, is the pill that yeah, you take? Yeah, I took it, um, contraceptive pills. Is it prescribed by a doctor? No, um, actually in the Philippines, um, contraceptive is um, everywhere. <laughs> like, you know, <laughs> and I don't know in other countries if they need prescription, but here we don't can buy it um, in maybe 60 pesos, like in your currency, it's like $2. What happens if you stop? Can you stop taking the the hormones? Yeah, or... I can, but the consequence, you know, um, because I still have um, testosterone in my body, you know, naturally, um, my testosterone, you know, flowings in my blood. Okay. But if I stop using contraceptives or you know, um, HRT, um, I starting to get, to be masculine again, and that's something I really don't like. <laughs> You know okay. to happen in my body 